Yeah, once you, once you start noticing the ground, you see a lot yeah, of frogs right. hopping. <laughs> Not so easy to catch, but you can see them. I'm Dr. Bob Broadman, and what I do here at Indiana Dunes is research amphibians. So I've gotten really interested in habitat restoration. A lot of amphibians fall into a category that, that I would call as hidden biodiversity. Salamanders are mostly under logs and underground. Sometimes people, when they look at wetlands, they just think that's kind of wasteland, it's not doing much. But they're super important as a resource for all sorts of wildlife. Not just the amphibians that live in it, but deer that walk by and they need water to drink. So iSwoop has an interesting idea. The premise is, have you ever gone to a national park? If the answer is yes, then you probably walk through somebody's research and have no idea the research was going on. So what iSwoop wanted was to have a vehicle for rangers to explain this to the public. And I think raising that awareness will help to get more research going on in the park. There's a saying that uh, when you love something, you're going to protect it. And if you don't know you love something, you're not going to go out of your way to protect it. So I think it's really important for kids to hold a frog, to hold a snake, and not be afraid of these things, understand how they fit in nature, and then they start to love it.